Hi guys, so in this video we will learn about how we can deploy our demo project to hugging phase uh, using Gradio. Okay, so let's start. So firstly go to hugging phase. Okay, go to new space. So spaces, then go to create a new space, then create a space name. Maybe write it here trying first okay after that we can choose it from here create you and we want to create it as a public okay once it's done then copy the command okay here here so just Paste it here, okay. the one that we copied from there. Okay, now trying first is over here, and what you can do is you can copy the code. Okay, create a app dot py. Okay, you can create directly copy from our black tutorial also. I think that you want it, so let's copy this. Okay and that will be a chatbot okay so we added this and now do commit okay as we do it do for do it on a github same way what you need to do over here also and if you are facing any other issue then go to settings then click it here about it okay and you can see I disabled it. Get terminal. Okay. okay. So this is what I disabled it for now. Okay. If you are facing any issues, okay, like your credential is not correct. Okay, and once it's done, then you can go to your trying first, then get add, get comment, hash name, then what we are doing, we are featuring the first try, okay, get add your name. password and it's done so if you go to again the first try okay it's building it up right now okay let's wait for some more second it's loading we'll see okay so if you type it now anything over here okay and it's there so you see we just gave in our input and it says it returned an output okay and it's deployed over here so if you want to try you can try it there also and this is a way how you can directly create your demo and deploy it on hugging face spaces okay and you can create if you are facing any issues on a credential side go to settings okay and create your access token okay create your new token so that will be your password and your out your user ID or user name will be this the one that you have it here okay so when you have any issues with the credential you can enter those things so for username this one and for access token this one okay I hope you liked it and thank you for watching